Michael and I are here today to invite you to join us for worship this Sunday for a special All Saints worship service. This is a time of year when First Church comes together to remember all those who we have lost over this past year. This year, we're also broadening the scope of that remembrance as we recall the tragic events of September 11, 2001, on this 20-year anniversary, and also the mounting deaths around the world from COVID-19. Along with our spoken prayers and our silent ones of our hearts, we'll also be adding special music of comfort and hope this Sunday. That's right, Barbara. Our First Church Choir will be joined by orchestra to present Morton Lardson's modern requiem, Luke Saterna, Light Eternal, and a beautiful orchestral meditation by the late George Walker entitled Lyric for Strings. Both of these works were composed from places of loss. For Morton Lardson, it was the final illness and subsequent death of his mother. For George Walker, it was the loss of his beloved grandmother. In both of these pieces, you will hear tender, aching beauty, but you'll also hear moments of uh, extreme calm and indeed hope and comfort. Along with the beauty of the music, we'll also be gathering with the saints of every time and place as we gather together around the table and celebrate communion. If you're joining us in person in the sanctuary, our choir and orchestra will be occupying the space here at the front, including some of these front pew boxes. So your favorite pew might not be available, so our helpful ushers will be here to guide you to an available pew. Whether you're joining us here in the sanctuary or whether you're planning to be part of our growing online community, we're looking forward to worshiping with you, the service of hope and an affirmation of God's love for all of us. A few reminders for Sunday worship. This Sunday is daylight savings time. And also for those of you in the city, this is New York City Marathon Sunday. Please join us as we celebrate this Sunday of hope and affirmation and the comfort of God who loves us. <laughs> 